Hi students we are discussing the topic of cross border alliances in which we are discussing mergers and acquisitions and in this topic we are going to talk about different phases of uh, mergers and acquisitions and in this topic we will be defining each phase uh usually uh the mergers and acquisitions they go through the integration of these uh, firms it goes through usually four phases but as i have already once discussed as well that um these models or these classifications they are depictions of reality which exists in various different forms uh we make these classifications so that we can understand in a particular situation how a particular set of events may occur so we want to predict ke jab merger or acquisition hota hai to uski kya kya stages ho sakti hain ye zaruri nahi hai ki yahi char stages ho jinka yahi pattern ho lekin ek aapko basic orientation mil jati hai ki ye in char stages se guzar ke aap ek successful merger or acquisition ko achieve kar sakte hain Okay, so there are four phases in this model. Uh, first phase is pre-merger and acquisition phase. The second is due diligence phase. Uh, the third one is integration planning phase, and fourth one is implementation phase. Now, it would be uh, quite clear to you from the nomenclature of these phases what would would be happening in each of these. phases but let's just elaborate so that you are clear what are these four phases uh, relating to all right so the pre merger and acquisition phase is the phase in which the merger has or acquisition has not taken place there has not been any formal process of that um, of that uh, activity it is pre merger and acquisition phase in which both the companies they would be looking for a particular for for prospective partners uh, they would be analyzing whether to go for a merger or an acquisition or another mode of uh, cross border alliance uh, it would be a phase in which negotiation and options are being tested so it includes screening of alternative partners based on an analysis of their strengths and weaknesses so uh, it's basically a phase of matchmaking uh, in which two different companies they try to make a match between each other analyze the strengths and weaknesses and try to see whether that fits with the strengths and weaknesses of their own company and whether that would be complementing the activities of their company or not so screening of alternative partners is uh, one of the major uh, activity of this pre merger and acquisition phase then the second phase is due diligence phase that is when the match is actually made uh, and uh, the two companies are uh, you know engaged to be wedded together uh, so um it focuses more in depth on analyzing the potential benefits of the merger so um th the match is made the companies have identified that okay this is the option that we want to go for and then uh the uh, actual task of integrating the actual task of merging together that is looked at that okay how is it going to happen whether it is going to be a merger how they are going to retain the legal entity uh, what is going to be uh, the, uh, the the integration start strategy and particularly uh, what uh, at this stage at the due diligence stage the companies would be concerned about is uh, that what is going to be the product market uh, combinations what type of product is going to be off, uh, offered to what kind of market and analyzing product market combination then the tax regulations because many times mergers and acquisitions they take place so that uh, um, the acquiring firms or the merging firms 
they can take benefit of uh, tax um, tax rebates which are available in a particular location or in a particular company uh, country so uh, tax regulations how that is going to affect ye to nahi hoga ki aap ikatthe milke kaam kar rahe hain aur ek particular legal वे से कर रहे हैं तो आपको डबल टैक्स के पे करना पड़े अपने मुल्क में भी पे करना पड़े नई जगह पे भी पे करना पड़े सो टैक्स रेगुलेशन एंड दैट इज दैट हैज अज इम्पैक्ट ऑन एक्चुअली डिसाइडिंग वेयर डू यू गो फॉर फॉर्मिंग योर न्यू ऑर्गेनाइजेशन देन द थर्ड थिंग इज कम्पेटिबिलिटी ऑफ एच आर हाउ द टू टाइप्स ऑफ कल्चर दे आर गोइंग टू बी वर्किंग टूगेदर सो इफ यू ट्राई टू मर्ज अमेरिकन कल्चर विद जापनीज कल्चर इट्स गोइंग टू बी टोटली प्रॉबली अ डिजास्टर बिकॉज इट्स गोइंग टू बी वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर द टू कल्चर्स टू मर्ज टूगेदर सो बट देर आर ऑबियसली देर आर um examples of uh, american companies working in uh, in japan and japanese companies uh, working in uh, america but uh, they definitely there are uh, compatibility of hr issues and then definitely there are going to be cultural issues you would be concerned about merging the cultures of the two entities and whether the culture is very much different or similar to the two companies coming together so these at at this stage at the due diligence stage you would be concerned about uh, these four type of issues obviously you will be concerned about other issues of uh, integration but these would be uh, most prominent ones uh, then the third phase is integration planning phase uh once you have chalked out what market you want to target what products you want to offer what are the tax benefits what are the hr issues how you are going to merge your hr together then is integration planning phase and you actually draw uh, and chalk out the plans uh, you know the feasibility report of each and every aspect of your organization so how finances are going to be managed how product development is going to be managed how production is going to be managed and the entire thing being chalked out written down uh, documented and uh, uh, that is the integration planning phase and finally when you have made all the plans you have basat aapne jab bana bicha di hai to uske upar phir then comes the implementation phase in which all your plans your strategies your uh, objectives all of that is going to come into action and plans are put into action in the implementation phase so these are the four phases of merger and acquisition pre m&a phase in which you look for alternatives then uh, the due diligence phase in which you uh, look at you 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 actually uh, choose an option and then you look at the different uh, uh, strategies to merge together then integration planning phase in which you actually chalk out all the plans and finally the implementation phase that that is the uh, four phases model of um, merger and acquisitions 